Because Family Matters, Arkansas soldiers saying a tearful goodbye to their families. You see this right here. Some emotional stuff. They're deploying to the Middle East for a very special mission that's going to last about a year. The National Guard troops were surrounded by their spouses. You can see hugging their kids and other soldiers at that special ceremony this morning. KRK 4s Rochelle Turner spoke to those families as they left. And tough stuff, Rochelle. It's hard to see someone leave. Yeah, that's right. Hillary, good evening to you. Soldiers have been preparing and training for this special mission through different communication exercises. And while it's tough for them being away from home, their main goal is to get back home safe. From hugs, kisses, and countless pictures. It was an emotional day at the Army Aviation Support Facility at Camp Robinson in North Little Rock. All sorts of craziness, emotions. So, but it's another one in the bag, I guess. A ceremony was held for 30 soldiers who will join members of the 244th Expeditionary Combat Aviation Brigade at Fort Hood, Texas. You know, keeping up with the news and what's going on, it always makes you a little nervous, makes you a little uneasy, but I know the good Lord takes care of them, so we don't worry too much. The troops will be deployed to the Middle East. The thing I'm most excited about is uh, helping troops uh, in other countries, because I'll be part of the command team, and it'll be my first time. That's actually probably what I'm more nervous about, because I'll be learning as I go. They will be going for Operation Spartan Shield and Operation Inherent Resolve. We'll be doing a lot of specialized equipment and uh, making sure that the soldiers that are over there have the communications that need to accomplish their missions. Soldiers say it's an honor to serve our country. It's the only thing that's truly giving me a sense of purpose. They thank their family for their countless support during the separation. It means a lot. It really does. Uh, to be able to have people back me up and to guide me along the way. And as family members wave goodbye, the goal remains the same. Now we're excited and uh, look forward to getting on with our mission and getting back home to our families. Now the unit is expected to be overseas for a year, but it could be a shorter deployment depending on what they get accomplished. Hillary? We definitely appreciate their service. Thank you so much, Rochelle. The Clinton Foundation fuses our